right, and five, four, three. Welcome to Peacekeeper Reaction. My name is Nathan. Thank you so much for joining us today, you guys. It's a very, very special episode. We're going to be checking out uh, new music. I guess this is new music. Let's see. Hold on. I shouldn't go flapping the gums. Yeah, two weeks ago, uh, Orbit Culture uh death metal band i guess that's what i would classify them as they're kind of a death metal band there uh they're awesome they have amazing uh vocals they have amazing riffs everything i've ever checked out from orbit culture has been great and go back and uh check out those previous reactions if you're an orbit culture fan and uh they're awesome they they stay heavily in my um uh um uh, f Instagram feed because uh, they have such a great fan site uh, at Orbit Culture Fans, I believe, uh, is the one. Yeah, they post the best memes. So if you guys are fans of Orbit Culture, uh, I'd recommend putting them on your uh, adding them because they're they're fantastic. Orbit Culture fans on Instagram is such a great uh, Instagram to follow. Anyways, enough of that. Uh, we're going to be checking out a song called From the Inside. This is two weeks uh, old only, so I'm a little bit late, but better late than never. So why don't we dive right into this, you guys. Orbit Culture uh, From the Inside. One sec here. Uh, I'm just bringing up the lyrics, sorry. I should have done this in advance, but I don't know what I'm doing. I need a Jamie, right? Uh, anyways, uh, let's do this. Orbit culture. Jesus fucking Christ, you guys. Can't even say it. It's so heavy. Orbit culture from the inside on Peacekeeper.
morbid culture. Oh, man, you hear that ending growl? Giving uh, Alex Terrible a run for his money on that one. Wow, that was deep. That was guttural. Uh, that's a scientific term for that, I believe. Uh, I love this. So, that, you know, the one of the most important songs that I listened to in the past two or three years of doing this show and the previous channel was the uh, track The Bee by Amorphous. And that track really uh, caught my attention because of the way that they meshed all these different elements of heavy metal and then, uh, you know, have also these elements of death metal. So like a, a fan, um, some, some people may not be into the growling vocals, but, you know, the death metal part of it. But then when you take the, you blend those elements perfectly with like a clear voice style as well, it kind of makes it more accessible. Like think about bands like Slipknot really did that kind of well, mixing the melodic with the death metalish attributes that aren't for everybody you know what i mean let's just be honest they're for me and they're for you because we kick fucking ass we're kick-ass dudes but not everyone is a kick-ass dude and <laughs> i don't know what i'm talking about but uh the, a band like this really is able to blend all these these uh and not losing any metal cred at all but are able to blend these for uh like if you're just a casual heavy metal fan you maybe like metallica you know stuff like that you can hear this and just instantly know this is fucking awesome i feel like this is for everybody everybody should be listening to orbit culture but um uh i just love this i was really taken into the zone with this track i was like fully feeling it allowing it just to take me on a journey uh, they had a couple of uh, build-ups and breakdowns that were really uh were crazy the last one there at the end was just uh uh, uh it was just so amazing and uh i thought this was great orbit culture you know i really need an old orbit culture kind of guide uh to really show me what's up with them because uh, i feel like i'm missing some stuff here uh so let me know in the comment section if that's you and for peacekeeper i'm nathan play safe i can put my arm back on